We know what John McCain meant to people in our generation, but what about the younger generation? All the high schools are back in session in Arizona, and students at Queen Creek High School today, they got a special civics lesson, a lesson in history, not only about a great American, but an especially great Arizonan. Team Charles' Brandon Hamilton continues our coverage. Unpredictable. Maverick. Admirable. Inspirational. A patriot or a countryman. It's very imaginable. Brave. A patriotic man. You'd expect him to, because he was a prisoner of war, you expect him to be just down and out. But no, he didn't let anything stop, not even brain cancer. I think John McCain was a great senator. And I think it's very sad that he had to go in the way he did. But I think he was very respectable and personable and really um, admirable in that way. Senator John McCain was a really great guy. And I didn't really know too much about him. But from what I've been learning just in, over the past week is that he's extremely inspirational, did things out of what he thought was right more than what other people were trying to tell him what to do. He was always speaking his mind and doing what he thought was best for the country. I mean, he was a good man and a good senator. He voted for what he thought was right and didn't let anything get him down. John McCain, yet again, he is a war hero. Even the people who captured him and held him even came to his uh, farewell in DC. He is also a national hero. He did help anybody who needed help. He didn't care for the cause. He didn't care about the personal needs of the person he wanted to help. He was held as a prisoner of war in Vietnam for over five years and he was brutally beaten and tortured and I think it's super respectable that he was able to come out of that and still serve his country. Like a lot of people they wouldn't be able to go through that and I don't know, like, be the kind of person that he was. We are dealing with high school students, so they're just at the beginning of the political process and learning what's going on. So hopefully, um, if anything, I would have hoped to instilled some respect.